This is Ramsey, right? Yeah. Do I know you? I've known your son Simon for a while. Can I help you with these bags? No, that's okay. My son's coming out. Yeah. So he's coming right out. He says, thank you so much. Are you okay? Yeah, this nice young man was going to help me with the bags. Yeah, it was just on my way in. I figured I'd help out. You okay? It's time to go, Mom, okay? You don't look so hot. Be in touch. Take care, Mrs. Ramsey. I want to send someone over to your place right now and collect all the fucking money you owe me, but look at you. What's the point? Rick? Look, I ain't gonna tell you again. Watch your goddamn mouth in front of my little sister. Fuck you, you mo! Oh. How you doing, Miss Santini? What's going on here? There's a little girl right here. You got any respect or what? Mrs. Santini, Jimmy Glass's boy here. He's coming into my place here. He's telling me he's taking all my stuff out of here and he's not paying for it. No, I'm telling you. Now, from now on, when this kid comes in here, he takes what he wants. You bag it up and you don't say a word. You don't even open up that register. You understand me? Mr. Santini, what? I didn't hear you. Okay, fine, Mr. Santini, you got it. Good. The restaurant, tomorrow night, 6 p.m. 7, Joe. Tomorrow at 7. I knew that. Whatever. Angela's supposed to be helping Lisa, but you know how Lisa is when she's stuck with Angela too long, and I do not need that. Oh! My gold earrings. I'll be in the garage. You're hopeless. You're a married woman. You should be home cooking and cleaning up this dump once in a while. You're not going out today, so forget about it. But you know that this is important to me. I... Oh, don't you dare scream at me, bitch! I'm the breadwinner in this family. That's right. When you're out and about trying to make a dollar, I am. I'm working 10 hours a day to support this lifestyle of yours. So don't give me those whiny, shitty excuses either, because I'm fed up to hear with them. Man, I just saw Tina all dolled up. You're one lucky boy. I had a stepmother who looked like that boy. Thanks. He was wearing a red suit with uh, a white beard. Well, anyway, uh, he asked me to give you something. He said that uh, since you've been such a good girl, that you deserved it. 